All right, let's just do the puzzle again. We'll go back to the other template. Hold on. There we go. Okay, so let's see what this puzzle is. All that the storyteller writes is destined to come true. Your opponent's attacks are no exception. Memorize the storyteller's tale and deflect your opponent's predetermined moves. Our enemy knights will appear in accordance with the storyteller's tale. Memorize the order of their attacks and deflect them using the knight's own moves against them. Okay. I'm afraid your real the story ends here, Professor. Now allow me to write the tale of your demise. <laughs> The knight drew his blade as the battle came to a close. He raised his blade overhead and delivered the finishing blow. Restart. Didn't work! Okay. <laughs> this is what he did. This is what he just fucking did. This is like impossible. Sidestaps, side stabs, thrust, and jump. So, downward stab, side stab, thrust, and jump. There we go, I finally got it. Look at Layton, what the hell? You murdered the knight. Well played, Professor, but are you, how do you fare in this tragic tale? Okay. Slash quickly, three blows before finishing the battle with a three-hit combination attack. Spin, overhead, side, side, overhead, spin. Spin, overhead, side, side, overhead, spin. Ha! Ha ha! Ha! Ho! Parry! Thrust! Dodge! Ha ha! Damn, look at this! Oh! We murdered him. All right, this is probably the final one. He was vanishing into thin air, veiled in the race of shadows. Overhead, spin, thrust, side, overhead. Overhead, spin, thrust. Oops, that's not thrust. Thrust, side, overhead, and then of course the ending has to be this. Parry, thrust, dodge, parry, parry, thrust, finish. Oh, yes. Got him. Layton fucked him up. That's how you do it, Layton. already seen the answer. Ho ho, fuck you, storyteller. That was teller. indeed an intriguing puzzle. Puzzle? You just sword fought your way out of that one. That wasn't a puzzle, asshole. <laughs> that was no puzzle. Ooh, sword fight. <laughs> Oh god! The knights killed each other. He did it. <gasps> Professor behind you! What the hell? Look how huge that one is! The axe man! Quick, another puzzle! Another fucking puzzle, quick! What an idiot, he broke the floor. 
Well, he's dead. Again. Professor! Link died again. He's dead. That's it. Oh, shit. Well, no. That was close. Go stab the storyteller, yeah. quick. Stab him. Storyteller. I'm afraid that the power of your pen is no longer absolute. Oh my god, a pun. <sighs> Stab him. You never fail to impress me, Professor Layton. Just tell me one thing. What exactly are you trying to achieve? You could say, I'm trying to lift the veil that hangs over the town. If that is indeed the case, the answer lies in the final story. This very evening, the great witch Vazella will be tried, and all stories will end. Oh, uh, he just tried to kill you, and now you're going to have a civil conversation with him? Okay. You should take your place in the gallery and observe the final trial. Permit me, if I may, to ask you a question, Mr. Storyteller. How about you stab him in his fucking eye, his one working eye? Why is it that you are here? What? You too should be watching in the gallery, watching as your twisted story unfolds. My twisted story? What do you mean by that? You must surely be aware that your story has already become twisted. Take our arrival in this town, for instance. Not to mention our being here at this very moment. Neither of these things could have happened in the story you wrote. In other words, what I am saying is that you are no longer the weaver of the tale. Oh! <sighs> hmm. It is as you say. The story I crafted is indeed been twisted out of proportion by someone else's actions. I'm not surprised that you realize it seems nothing passes by those sharp eyes unnoticed. That is exactly why I decided to write the grand finale. Prevent any further distortion. You mean to suggest that by ending the story you could return this town to its original state? To its original state, you say? I'm afraid that is not the case. The entire truth behind Labyrinthia is sealed by a single spell. That's right, the final spell. The final spell, you say? When that spell is invoked, Labyrinthia's true form will become clear to all. What, what, what kind of spell is it? It is a spell that has always been hidden within plain view. What's that supposed to mean? Essentially, the final spell is concealed at the start. The final spell is concealed at the start? What on earth are you talking about? I thought you, you two took it upon yourselves to unravel mysteries, do you not? Do what, it, do what you will with it. Very well. Now then, I believe there's just one thing that you may wish to hear from me. What would that be? Firstly, you would say if I told you that this twisting of your story is leading towards a grand finale quite different than the one you had planned. What do you mean? You see, Link, you supposedly gave up your life to the Great Witch Bezella, did you not? As a result, the person thought to be Bezella is being tried in court at this very moment. Now, if you permit me to ask, do you, do you happen to know the name of the accused? Naturally, I wrote the name myself. There can be no question. Of course, the name of the accused is... Espella Cantabella. What are you saying? You mean my Espella is? Yes, the accused at this evening's trial is none other than Espella Cantabella. That can't be! That's preposterous! This is your doing! What have you done, Leighton? You ask me what I've done, Mr. Storyteller, but I am a solver of puzzles and mysteries. I do not concern myself with scheming. My Espella? What? How is she accused? Perhaps you'll have to go and see for yourself, Mr. Storyteller. Do you think it's a good idea to just stand here lamenting your daughter's fate? What's to be done? Well, Mr. Storyteller, I will be returning to court. I'd like to witness this grand finale with my own eyes. Ah, yes, before I leave, there's just one thing I'd like to make clear. I do not intend to simply take my place in the gallery and observe the trial. Naturally, there's only one place for me to stand in order to unravel all of these mysteries. You mean to say, he'll stand as the defender? Ha ha ha. Unfortunately, the defender's position is already taken. Moreover, Mr. Storyteller, I am the one who knows the truth. 
The true identity of the Great Witch Brazella, that is. How, how can you know? There is only one place at which I should stand in order to assert such a fact, and that is not to the side of the defense. Surely you can't mean. I anticipate seeing you again soon, Mr. Storyteller. To be continued! Dun dun dun! Dun 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 dun! Okay, great. Let's save up. This is cool. The climax.